I think that Gareth and the players have got a lot of credit in the bank for what they've achieved over the last few years and the performances in the last two tournaments. I think there's a little, for me, I, I, I've been part of England teams as a coach and a player, went to eight tournaments and understand that when you play these types of friendly nation league type games, they don't inspire you in the same way as the real meaningful games do. And I know sometimes that's disappointing for fans to hear. You know, I've been a player and you know, I've been there myself where you just don't quite get up for it the same as a World Cup qualifier or a, a European Championship qualifier or certainly a tournament game. But the reality of it is that's what happens. And I know that England fans, 90,000 of them at Wembley last night, they're going to watch a performance, they want the team to do well. Um, don't always see that side of it, but the reality of it is we've got a World Cup coming up in two months and that's where the England players and manager need to peak, not now. And they have peaked in the last two tournaments and have brilliant results. I know they've not won the tournament, but when I think back to my career, they've, they've, they've achieved exceptional things to get where they've got to. So I've still got full faith in them. I still think they'll have a good tournament. Yeah, there are some issues to iron out, um, some players to come back from injury, but I still think that will cause a lot of teams a lot of problems.